Hey guys, it's your boy Nick back at you with another video. And in this one, um, we are, as you, you can see from the title, we are doing, um, some ticks, some tips and, um, some tips and tricks for Beast Miss 2020 and Beast Worm Simulator. Um, so this is my first Beast Worm Sim vid. Um, expect more. As you can see, I'm, I'm pretty good. Not the best, but yeah. Alright, anyways. First tip. Um, now this is mainly for people if you haven't, like, got in the game yet or so. Um, or if you just haven't claimed all your quests, just claim your quest. Because, claim your Beesmas quest. Because then you can focus on all of them. And, it, it's, it's just gonna help you get all these done. Um, that will bring us to a second point. Um, use these. Like, use the special things you get from for completing the quests, like, you can, um, use that, and I'm not gonna use, um, on its yard art and Bucko, or Riley Bee's, um, thing, because I wanna save those, but, yeah, um, do that, you can... You can dig into the Beesmas Feast, big old turkey legs. Um, he, yeah, the Beesmas Feast gives you a lot of stuff. Really helps to have it, especially if you're like a noob. You can do the Snow Bear. Now, if you can't do this because you need help, you just ask for help. Um, I can't do a level 7, so I'm gonna ask for help later on today. Um, what I think is one of the best ones. Oh, God. Wait, no, I, don't, I really don't want to kill that rhino beetle. Alright, whatever. What I think is one of the best ones is the stockings. Because every time you're getting a free bee equip. Um, and you're also getting other stuff. Like, most of the times you get micro converters. And you, you, get, you just get a lot of extra good things um so that's that also next don't spam your snowflakes or your gingerbread bears unless you need to for a quest you should save these so you can buy stuff um in the bee bears catalog because they will 100 percent um they will 100 percent help um, yeah, so, alright, so, my next tip is, don't kill those, don't kill those, don't kill those, alright, I'm not gonna kill them, because, my next tip is, um, do your bug runs, especially now, um, that they have, like, Snowflakes and gingerbread bears that can drop, and I think sometimes you can get bee equips. I don't know, but um, yeah, like you should really um, you should really really be doing your bug runs. I'll show you like how I do them. Basically, they're just you go around and kill every mob on the map. I'm not talking about like the bosses, but other stuff see look like i'm getting uh, so many snowflakes from this and snowflakes help a lot like and they're really good if you decide to use them for some reason but um yeah so also what i like to do when i'm doing my bug runs is so i go to i go to the um go to the pineapple then i come here and do this memory match and then what i do is i come here and you don't need to do the memory match also i'm gonna give you some tips for the snow bear after this but um so then i say like out of the mobs the spider and the werewolf are the best ones now i don't i don't know where my spider is 
Um, I don't think I killed it. Yeah. I don't know where my spider is. Um, yeah, so I go from, I just, you can just follow this route. You can do it. You can really do it any way you want. I do it this way. But yeah, this is very important. Especially now that there's no flakes and gingerbread bears. So then I come up here. And I do the werewolf. I don't know about you guys, but I personally, like, I, yeah, as you can see, they drop B equips. Now, that's actually my first um, B equip from a mob, but it was a pinecomb. Yeah, I have a lot of B equips. Um, Alright, let's beat these mantises. Um, okay, so get these pineapples, snowflakes, everything as well. Um, also, please sub and like. So now I do this. Yeah, please sub and like. We do gaming. We'll do more bee swarm. We'll really, we'll do a lot of different things. Um, a lot of different things. Little coconuts. Um, oh, I think there were sunflower seeds there all right um all right so then i normally come down here to rose sorry if this is a long video but whatever um all right so i come down here to rose yep, free snowflake token might as well pick that up just collect all this stuff like I said, they can be really important. Um, alright, so, sorry if there's extra noise. Just, um, yeah. So, so yep. I do mushroom. Then I come here and do clover, and then I do blue flower. And that's basically my bug run. I don't necessarily do the bosses every time. Especially because they're not uh, every hour they're not ready. You could like you can do this every hour, you could do this every five minutes and just beat the rhino beetles and ladybugs, really. You can just keep doing oh my rhino beetle has not respawn. Alright, so um that was a bug run. Now snow bear tips. So before you do a snow bear, you wanna reset your character and you want all of your bees to sleep. That way, they're gonna have more energy. Um, Alright, they're not sleeping, so you might just have to reset your character again. But they should be sleeping now. Yep. Alright, so just let them sleep. Um, yep, and as you see, they're all gonna start sleeping. So this way, they're gonna have full energy. Also, you wanna, you as I said, you can get help if you have oils. You wanna pop an oil. Um, yeah, if you have oils, you wanna pop an oil. You can do a tropical drink. You can you can use stingers too. All right. So as you said, as I said, you can ask for help, and so you wanna make sure your spider is not in the field. You want to make sure your spider isn't there. I don't know what's going on with my spider. Is it going to come? It's not. I don't think I killed it. I don't think it's on cooldown. It's not. Alright, whatever. So then, you want to summon the snow bear. I'm not going to do it now. But then you want to get your rage tokens. And you want to come here. Now, you're going to want to keep just running. And running and running and running. So you don't get hit. Also, you can go for those snowflakes that the... Um, thing is gonna drop, but it kind of decreases your chances of actually like getting them. So that's basically the snow bear. Um, so for some quests, you have to catch some of uh, science bears falling beast missiles. I find that annoying, but I say the best field to do it in is spider because it's these it, it's smaller than smaller than coconut. Wait, did I just beat my spider? Oh, I, I really don't know what happened. It's smaller than coconut, and it's a pure white field. 
I, it's easier to see them in your way. Also, at night, it's easier to see them. Alright, now, we're gonna talk about bee equips now. So, um, bee equips. Basically, um, if you want to complete Bee Beer's quest, he gives you bee equip storage, he gives you all the stuff, and he also gives you a few bee, bee equips. So, as you can see, I have quite a few bee equips. Now, basically, if you go, alright, this is pretty good elf cap. So, level. This is what level your bees need to be to equip it. Um, limit three. Color any. Alright, limit three. That's how many you can have on equipped on a, on bees. Potential. The more the potential, the better it is. And then these are the stats down there. So that's actually a pretty good elf cap. Um, toy drum. It's a pretty stupid one. Um, toy horn. Level nine to potential. Um, yeah. So there's that. And then so the pine cone. The pine cone I got actually is pretty good, but I don't think I have level nine of any of those bees. Um. All right. So basically, once you complete the bee bee quest, he gives you that um so i have this bubble light now it is a potential for its level eight it's a really good thing but it has to have the energy mutation so i can't put it on anything these miss talk this is good now minus 18 percent energy so this means this beesman this bees miss top right here would be perfect on exhausted bees, bees, but I can't use them, so, um, we're just gonna put this on a brief bee, because why not, um, alright, so, yeah, that's basically bee quips in a nutshell, um, and then I think, the last thing is how to get these quests done, um, Riley and Bucko Bee Quest are hard. You need to use fuel boosters on those. For the mushroom and blue flower and just the pollen in general. Otherwise, all the other quests are pretty easy. Um, alright, so I think that's it. Also, you can get secret bee equips from the Snow Bear, Vicious Bees, and, um, Ant Challenge. Also, last thing, promise, if you go inside this Bee's Mystery, it's hollow. And there's a free gingerbread bear, I already claimed it, but yeah, right there. And then also, you can come on top of here, you can come over here, you can jump on the stinger machine, or maybe you don't need to, you can come up here, and the top of the business tree is hollow, so there's a family of bears there. Anyways, guys. Yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. If you want to see more bee swarm, comment. Please, uh, please like. It would do us a favor. Um, and more, and you can give us suggestions in the comments. And um, yeah. Bye. I guess.